Hello and welcome back to the channel and now you join me for this week's Forzathon guide called Built Ford Tough which wants you to own and drive the 1986 Ford F-150 XLT or the 2017 Ford F-150 Raptor to complete all the challenges with. Now I went for the 2017 F-150 Raptor uh, as I assume most of you guys will probably own this one. If you don't it's only 63,000 credits from the auto show so relatively cheap. Now I've also created a tune for you guys to use, it's called Forzathon, share code is 982-277-132 and hopefully that should help you out a bit. Now the first challenge here is nice and easy and it only wants you to win a dirt race. So to do this we're going to head over to the Caldera Scramble, I know it doesn't say that's what it is but this is because it's currently a seasonal event. Anyway it's located on top of the La uh, Caldera Volcano. Share code for the races on your screen here. It's called Forzathon Scramble and it's two laps with no AI driver tiles, so it's super easy and it should take you well less than two minutes to complete this first challenge, uh, especially with a tuned F-150. Now the next challenge here again is easy. It wants you to earn three stars at Danger Signs. So to do this, I headed over to the Hotel Danger Sign, which is where I'd normally do these challenges. Three stars on here is only 450 feet, so as long as you hit that jump at over 110 mile an hour, you'll smash the three star target. Now you don't have to get three stars in one run, it could be done over a couple of runs, as long as you get final of three stars. Now the final challenge here wants you to earn two ultimate wreckage skills. So to do this, I recommend heading over to the main Horizon Festival uh, sort of drag strip area. You can also do this in the town of Guanajuato. Obviously, we all know what a wreckage skill is. An ultimate variant of that is just four wreckage skills in fairly quick succession. This is a great place to do it. There's lots of things to smash into. It's mainly things like shrubs and cacti. However, it's really, really easy to do it because there's plenty of them around. Like I said, you can also head to some of the towns, places like Guanajuato, where there's lots of smashable objects on the side of the road as well. Now, hopefully this guide has helped you out. If you're struggling with any of the challenges, then please do let me know down below in the comments. I'm more than happy to help you out. Um, if you're new to the channel and it did help, I'd very much appreciate if you could subscribe and dropping a like massively helps me out as well. But apart from that, folks, I want to thank you very much for watching. Make sure you stay safe and take care.